Hello, ladies and gentlemen, it's I, the British Wolf, and today I am playing The Wild 8. Now, I think this game is still in development. It's a survival game, and it was found on Game Jolt. Uh, I know I'm late to the party, as I am with every other freaking thing, but let's just see how this goes, shall we? The type of weapon that you're wearing affects the speed of your attacks. You wear your weapons? <laughs> Bit of a type of that. I'm alive! Canned food, now it's a luxury. Yeah, it kind of is. What's this? More canned food? I've got a fist. Suitcase I can't open. A plant. Okay. A couple of suitcases around. A little disappointed I can't open them. Okay, so B. Uh, gonna build one right. What would that freak out? Here. So, do I punch them? Yes, I do. Okay, so punching's effective. Oh my god. Is that a ball? Why is the ball upside down? Also, I can't mine anymore from that. Punch it! Punch it with your manly fists! Okay, so... That's a workshop. Oh, gotta enter the shelter. I can build a campfire! <laughs> Punch it. Get away from there. Get away from my camp. I'll punch you, dear. I'll punch you in the butt. There we go. Punchy, punchy, punch. Just keep punching it. Keep punching it. Keep punching it. Keep punching it. That ball is upside down. I'm not even kidding. I guess winter really does turn creatures around. Punch the stone. Punch it with your manly fists. This is how manly men do things. We punch stone like manly men. Keep punching it. Keep punching it. Keep punching it. Is this infinite? Need to warm up. Close to that fire, my friend. Huh. Upgrade! Hooray! Now I just need more crap. I like the way that it's uh, upgrading here, like, it's not a, um, it's not like, what the dick was that? <laughs> what the dick was that? Why did you throw that? Now we have to go collect it. Oh! One ton of food's good. That's nice. Keep punching that rock. Punch it. Punch it real good. Also, what do we have here? We have a healing salve. Uh-oh. Fire's getting a bit low. Gotta get past this. Gotta get myself some wood. It's 8 a.m. We are doing fine for the most part. Okay. Uh, da -da -da. Bone extraction. I like, the, as I was saying before, the creepy noise appears. I uh, like the way this works, because normally in games you have to like level up and stuff like that to uh, 
advance. But in this case, you just yeah, you're just punching things. You're just collecting stuff. And I like the way it works in the fact that I don't have to put in too much time and effort to actually get to a reasonable state of survival. Hmm. Gold defense, rabbit trap, sharpened bone. Interesting. Gotta eat my tin of beans. Because my hunger was getting pretty low real fast. Okay, so check the smoke to the east. Because that's the north. It's definitely the east. Getting cold, I should probably head back. I don't think I'll be able to make it down there without any appropriate uh, clothing. Seems like I might have to survive in this location for a while. High risk of being poisoned. Oh, aren't you just a bundle of sunshine? There we go, nice and toasty. Nature! Punchy, punch, punch, punch. Any more soup around that was like super useful? No pun intended. Yes, there is soup. I'm happy about this. Need more stone for these. Punch and punch and punch and punch and punch. Punchy do. So it does seem like the stones are infinite. Definitely need shoes. Oh, can get a wooden outfit. That sounds positively delightful. Oh, that's a that's a camera switcher right there. That's a switchy do. Did I not equip the- Oh, I just learnt the recipe. That's what I did. I should really do the basic things here. I don't even know the basics of this game. I'm so stupid. Oh, I get colder faster in blizzards. That's okay, I have a basic knowledge of what I'm doing. A basic knowledge, I'm not saying I'm great. Also starving again, hot damn! You starve fast in this game. Ooh, berries. Hopefully northern berries are good for me. Help stay with hunger. Yep, yeah, okay, that's better than the mushrooms. So the mushrooms seem to have a poison chance, and I'm not too eager to be poisoned. Click, click, punch it, and punch it, and punch it, and punch, and punch. Punch like a manly man. Oh. Used only for medical purposes. Uh, oh crap. There we go. I am man, I am fire. Man get erection from making fire because man's so pleased with himself. Okay, I have a club. And I shall beat things with it. Also, I need a crap ton more stone, and that will help me get uh, help me get a wooden suit. Will help me stave off other things, like you know hypothermia, apparently. I mean, I don't really know what properties wood would have against, you know, freezing. But it's important, so let's do that. Ok, 
Okay, so the one outfit needs... Oh, one more stone! Smashing! Behold, man has created a wooden outfit. That is literally barely a change from what you just had. My god, man. Need more wooden stone. If I can get that up. Yes, it is gluttony, but it's necessary. Again, there you go slow. It's berries, for God's sake. Yeah. Hello, dear. Be my food. <laughs> get here. You shall be in my stomach! Don't you come near me, because that boar is following me with purpose. And I do not like it. That tune always got stuck in my head in Monster Hunter. Yes, delicious meat. Meat, meat, meat to eat. I really needed like a bow and arrow because... Oh, holy crap, that was effective. I really need a bow and arrow because this stick is going to take for fucking ever to kill things with. Mmm, delicious roasted meat. Clunk, 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 clunk. Thank God stones are infinite, eh? Chop, 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 chop. Yeah, this would be terrible if I uh, didn't have all these many, many trees around. But thankfully I do, so I can beat these trees down like a madman. Die, nature, die. So, venison definitely seems like something I need to focus on. But, I mean... Did not get much wood. Mostly because I just blew most of it on the fucking thing. Definitely need strength. And I will get terrain orientation as well. Because I am man. Nothing special. Need a new stick. Hmm. If I get more, I can get a sharpened bone. Which is handy. Clunk. 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 <sighs> Check the smoke to the east of the crash site. You say that, but I'm not so certain you'll lead me to victory. Not the campfire. Not the campfire. I need the warmth to warm my bunions. Oh, look at my butt. I've got to warm it up here. It's so very cold. Also, that... Thing is casting a creepy ass shadow. Well, that shaft and bone could be handy. Be fair, a lot of this could come in handy. Get it closer. There we go. Clink, clink. I'll wait until my hunger gets really down low and then I'll bung the uh, meat down my gullet. Because all this exercising and resource gathering is eating into my uh, hunger quite a bit. And I don't want to overdo that. Because I think that might be a mechanic. It seems to be going down quite a bit faster than it should be at times. Bone claws. Oh. Interesting. Gonna do a Wolverine our way. Nice. <laughs> and get that down your food hole. 
Get it down your food pipe. Oh, that is super effective. Yes. Don't inherently need the healing salve yet. I'll probably regret that decision soon enough, I know, but... Right now, I just want to focus on the other things. Hmm. I don't seem to have much use for anything right now. Okay. I gotta get moving. Don't you follow me, Bar. I will kill you. Oh, it's a little bunny rabbit. I must kill! No berries? No berries? No berries? I want the berries. Getting real cold real fast. Plane's tail. Oh, I've got to go north. So chilly, though. It's so chilly. Sound like a goat screaming. Also, I don't like this whole adventuring at night thing because it feels like bad things are going to happen. Come on, Mary, we've got to get moving. Hunger's getting low, as is your, uh, as is your temp. And I want to keep you alive. Mostly because if I don't keep you alive, then we're both burned. <laughs> You'll die, and then I have to start up again. It did say an emergency zone, though. Make sure this constitutes as emergency. Hopefully cooking them reduces the chance of me getting poisoned. I somehow doubt that, but I'd like to hope so. Okay, so obviously it seems like there's going to be a lot of back and forth gathering here. Oh my god, this blizzard is not letting up. Also, these mushrooms are kind of alright. I haven't been poisoned yet, so I'm assuming cooking them is a smart idea. Can't craft much though. Like, I'm at my limit when it comes to crafting right now. I can't do much building-wise otherwise, either. I can make a healing salve and a trap, but that's got limited uses each. I don't want to need that Jenny for, though. Let's 
it's gotta have some use, right? Learn this. Getting a mighty frost on my bottom. Hold it! Hold it! Hold it! Hold it! Hold it! Hmm. Right there. Mushrooms. There we go. Gotta stay toasty. Also, while I'm here, fry up some mushrooms. Bouncing hunger and uh, cold is a bit difficult. But, uh, I mean, the map's bloody huge. So I don't inherently know what I'm supposed to do with some of this information. Get here so I may feast upon your flesh. Give me that supple delicious flesh of yours, dear. I shall smack you on the bottom. Get here. I'm not through with you. One more hit should do it. Die, foul creature! When I say foul creature, I mean creature I wish to eat. I can't see anything because of these freaking trees. Okay, my temporary campfire was over here. We just bung some of these on. Now lob some meat on. Oh no, did I forget to pick up those mushrooms I cooked? I feel like I did. Dig nabbit. I got a lone bone, that's all right. The bone claws would probably be better. Cook some mushrooms, because they cook quickly, and they seem to be good for short-term food items. The meat's definitely a long-term thing, like you do not squander the meat. You make sure you use every single bit you can get from it. Okay, so base is back this way. I'm not gonna use the meat. I'll only use that when my uh, health get my hunger gets really freaking low. I need to kill more things up. It's a very slow process of hunting, but it works. I am man! Hear me beat you over the head of a club! Come on! Get here! Get back here! I'm not done with you yet. Slap it! Slap it! Come here! Beat you! I shall beat you with my mighty club, for I am man! Very primordial, isn't it? Hooray! Delicious meaty goods! All for me, no one else, cause screw nature. 
Oh look, we're back at the plane. That's handy. Hmm. For space to evade, that sounds like it can come in handy. Let's beat the crap out of this rock and then maybe we'll be able to do that. <coughs> Nope, need more wood. I gotta get wood. Yeah, there's jokes like that been made about a billion times in survival games, so I'm not gonna bother making the erection jokes about that. <laughs> I'm a different class. If I was to make a penis joke, it would be about something completely inappropriate. Yes, yeah, completely inappropriate. Good. Cook the meat. Put the meat on the fire. Cook the meat. Enjoy the meat. Remember, you must eat their brains to gain their dear powers. What are you looking at? What are you looking at, tusks? Huh? Huh? Ooh. Evade. Ooh. Evade. Oh, stamina bar. I only just noticed that one. To be fair, I haven't used it that often. So, that makes sense. Oh, suddenly very calm and chilling music. And it's a little discordant, which makes me a bit anxious. <laughs> Why the sudden discord there? I think I'm doing pretty good. Punch, 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 punch. I don't necessarily know where I can use that generator, but, uh, yeah, I'm feeling pretty good about this. I feel like I've done, like I've done a good, you know? Yes, take the healing salve. <gasps> a torch! Oh, specials, right, that would explain it. I was wondering how you went from medical to torch. I mean, surely torch would be the first thing you learn to do, as opposed to, you know, a healing self. Because those things are very difficult to make, you know? Like, being an apothecary is not easy. Alchemy in general is a big clusterfuck of maybe it will kill them, maybe it won't. So you want to figure a torch, which is just basically a piece of wood on fire, would be easy. Oh, granted, a piece of wood on fire isn't inherently a brilliant torch, but you get the idea. Yes, I shall individually punch all of these trees down, but I am man and I destroy nature. Yes, I shall take a torch. And with this torch, I shall set fire to things. No upgrades yet? Hmm. I think I may have maxed out all my upgrades. I still don't know where I can put this generator to use. That looks like a cluster of rocks. Hang on, what? what's that? Looks like there might be a building over there. Well, I think we all know what this means. Okay, so I obviously don't have room for those plants, so I'm gonna have to hope that I don't need them for a salve at any point. I bagged up both my uh, shelters. I have enough material, yes? No? Now I do it for an emergency campfire. So all I gotta do is make it over to that area, which I think might be a house. And then there will be more, more rabbits and more things. And I don't have an inventory bag for some reason, because apparently that bag isn't big enough for more than what you can fit in your belt. 
It looks like there's a house over there, and if I'm right about that, then I can actually put this generator in, maybe. Question mark. Possibly. Who knows? Oh, there's my old fire camp. Hello. Hello, campfire. You were good to me. <laughs> ah, I'm heading into another area. What I thought was a, a house was up here. <gasps> Yes, I was right! It's a house! It's a station of some sort! Oh my god! So I'm trying to put the freaking generator in. Yes! I did it! I'm alive! It is interesting. And I know for a fact that it has a uh, multiplayer, which is um very fun sounding. Like I've seen people do that before, but you know, never uh, never occurred to me that maybe they have a different version. At least I think I've seen them do it before. I could be wrong, but I'm proud of myself. Look at him. He's doing a little dance of joy. But yeah, this seems interesting. I I know it's difficult, but once you get certain basics down and you start forcing yourself to do things, it gets a little easier. Oh, bloody hell, I really am. <laughs> I really am late here. It's uh, fall 2016. This is already on Steam. Uh, yeah, guess, uh, guess I am late to the party. So yeah, there's a multiplayer... There's obviously going to be more because this is a pre-alpha demo. That is how late to the part I am. And also cheap because I just wanted to demo to test out and stuff like that. But yeah, it seems like it's a full game already, the looks things, if it's released last year. And uh, I'd say it's fun. I mean, <clears throat> as I said, it can get hard, but that's a part of surviving in winter. And I'm not sure if there is an end game. But I'm assuming there is. I don't think it's like uh, The Long Dark, where it's survive and die. I don't think it's that. But, um, yeah. I'm quite, I, I quite like it. The top-down perspective is a little slow and hunger and cold. Can, well, mostly hunger. can be a pain in the ass, but otherwise it's good. Yeah? It's a nice little game. and I still don't know what the hell that random noise was on the first night. Oh, there's a wolfie. Hello! But it's a decent, like, atmosphere. You do get a bit paranoid at night because you think it's going to be like a don't starve situation where randomly wolves will just come and try and maul on your butt. But, yeah, it's fairly fun. And I like it. And I'm definitely going to check out the price of this later. Because, again, I, I'm late to the party and probably no one plays this anymore, but... If you are watching this and you haven't seen it before, or you haven't played it before, as I said, there is a demo. Uh, this was on uh, Game Jolt. And um, if you go in there, try out the demo. See if you've got a taste for it. And if you do have a taste for it, check out the game. Because I honestly like this. And it's not often that I come across a survival game where it's sort of like, yeah, you know, this this will do. Mostly it's like, they feel cheap or bad, but it's a good game, and I can genuinely recommend it for now. And as I said, multiplayer, it's gonna be chaos. But uh, yeah, this has been the Wild Eight. I have been the British Wolf, and I will see you in the next video. Ta ta for now.